Welcome back to another episode of Dreaded and Abroad. I'm your gracious host, King Osachi. And on this episode, we are in beautiful Montego Bay, Jamaica. No, it's all good. Okay. You only get one time to make a first impression. It's all good. <laughs> I'm just trying, I'm trying to get some tree before I get on the resort, you know what I'm saying? Tree, like them green ones over there? Mm -hmm, the ones you put in the air. Oh, the ones you put in the air? Yeah. Uh -huh. Welcome to paradise. <laughs> Alex, and I'm your no problem driver, and I'll be taking you safely to your destination, yeah? That sounds good yeah, to me, we, man. We're going heading out to Jules Grant, yeah? Yep. Yeah. Our beautiful place, all right? Thank you. All right, so each and every day, I live with Gunnar Rocky in the pool. We have the amazing Aquafed. I'm on TV. Y'all remember me to do with the camera? Hey, How y'all doing? Y'all now watching Dread in the Broad. Make sure you hit the like button, subscribe, and share. Let's keep the party going. What's going on? Yeah. What's going on? Marvel, stop. Feel that? Feel that? 
I'm just a man, bro. I'm just a man, bro. We going out of here. I was never here. Some pointers, you know what I'm saying? Some assistance. See, cut away. And then he hit me and was like, "Yeah, I'm gonna need to bring Tasha in on this." <laughs> <laughs> he was like, "My anxiety levels is like, I feel like it gotta go right." And I'm gonna need Tasha. I'm gonna need Tasha. I'm gonna need Tasha. These are all facts. Tasha is amazing. I mean, <laughs> I mean, Tasha lined it up. She favorite. set it up. Everything was just, I mean, like, I was like, yeah, that. Yeah, all that sound good. We got that quarantine money. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, I think I told I used to, I was like, I used to like, he was like, yeah, it costs like three, four hundred, five hundred dollars. I don't know. I was like, okay, what it costs? <laughs> that. I want that. I want that. And so, uh, 
I know. You want me to go story. Look at me. 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 I don't want to miss the story. <laughs> I call you back in like five minutes. <laughs> So I went out there and I, I told her the story about how I talked to, you know, my, my mom, my, you know, went to the cemetery talking to my dad. Told all the important people. I called her dad. I talked to her dad. Mm. You know what I'm saying? She still didn't, I don't think it even dawned on her that something was going on. And I was like, you know, I asked everybody for their approval, you know, you know, if we got married. But you, and she still ain't get it at that point. I moment. thought he was going to say my baby. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, I was like, Aaliyah? Yeah, so at that point, I was like, okay, it's perfect time, and she still has no clue. So I was like, so now, I need to ask one question from you. And then I got down on one knee, yeah, like a gentleman, and I showed her the ring, and I couldn't even give her the ring, because the tears just fell, and she went into all of this. <laughs> It was, yeah, I mean, it was like, I was like, hey, baby, uh, <laughs> I gotta do my part. Right? <laughs> <laughs> you know, like, I, you know, I, can't do. You know, I don't really know how it happened if you don't do it in this manner. So I'm trying to, <laughs> I'm trying to get that, you know, to get so I, I stood up, I gave her a hug, like, you know, I still need your hand. Right? <laughs> <laughs> According to the way. Right, right, right. right. Sure we got how I saw it on TV. You know what I'm saying? That's how they, they did the joint. But anyways, finally got her hand, put the ring on her, and she just been mute ever since then. Hey. Hey, somebody said y'all was sleeping. I said all the time. No, not up in here. Let's get the boss, mommy and Bam. Shit. one of y'all for taking y'all time to come help us celebrate our birthdays. Love, love y'all. Thank you so much. Hey! hey. 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 hey.